Good afternoon, everyone, and happy Yakuza Friday. Welcome back to another episode of our Yakuza 3 Remastered Let's Play. On to episode 16. Last episode, we confronted Konda in a love hotel by posing as lovers with Rikia. That was interesting. Uh, proceeded to punch Konda a whole lot. And then we did some running around with Rikia. Um, that's pretty much where we were left off. We're about to go back to Serena to fill Date in on everything. So if you guys are excited for today's video, let me know with a comment wherever that comment section is. Anyways, let's just get right on over to Date-san, which is honestly kind of just around the corner so i'm not gonna do too much cutting one thing that i am upset about is this ice cream place right here they got rid of the little restaurant that i used since yakuza zero to fill up my health i can't remember the name but they uh they like had like some yakisoba and like that uh, spicy fish roe and uh, they got rid of it. Like, come on. I'm away for two years. Now it's just gone. No, I don't want it. Really? You really want to do this now? When I'm literally right there. Oh, okay. Pop. Oh, you blocked it. Oh. I was gonna throw you at your buddy. That wasn't gonna work if he's gone already. I'm sorry. Give me a break, man. You're a freaking monster. An apologetic 5k. Don't want to fucking hear it. Get the hell out of here. What was that? I like it came from the alley. This is it. Be a bookie, you bastard. If you ever poke your nose in where it doesn't belong again, it'll be the last thing you ever do. Enough of this. Doing this isn't gonna... Ch doing this to me isn't gonna change anything. Shut your yap. Ugh. This is your last morning. Don't ever show your face around here again. Hey, you all right? Yeah. Thanks for stopping. You're hurt. Do you need help? Is this a side story or is this actually part of the main story? Don't worry, it was nothing. Wait, are you Kiryu-san? You know me? I used to be a member of the Dojima family. My name is Ibuki. Ibuki, sorry, I don't remember you. Back then, I was just a flunky, so it's not surprising you don't remember me. Is that right? Sorry, I don't remember. No, it's fine. It was over 10 years ago. Ugh. Hey, you don't look so good. Can't just leave you here. I'll make sure you get home safe. Thank you. Thank you so much. Is this a story? Side story? Huh? What? What? What is this place? It used to be a restaurant I ran for the Yakuza. I called it the Kamarocho Castle. It's been a restaurant for a long time now, though. Now it serves as headquarters for the Honest Living Association, the HLA. I'm their representative. Honest Living Association? What's that all about? The HLA is an organization that helps former Yakuza members get out of the business and start making an honest living. We do things like help them find work, give them low interest loans if they need them, things like that. I see. At first, we used my house for the HLA headquarters, but a lot of our members need a place to stay too. So we converted my, we converted my restaurant into our dormitory and headquarters. The castle dungeon, the castle dungeon look comes from the theming of the original restaurant. HLA members say it kind of looks like a prison, so it helps them keep on the straight and narrow. 
Yeah, and I guess it's been a contributing factor in rehabilitating our members back to into normal society. Interesting, never knew a place like this existed. Yes, sir. We've tried to keep it under wraps, so I'd guess most Hoja members have never heard of it. Who founded the HLA? Kashiwagi-san. Okay, so I know this is actually part of the story. What? Kashiwagi-san. It's hard for people to believe the Yakuza make their way out and uh, try to earn an honest living in the outside world. Kashiwagi-san knew this and saw how much these guys were suffering. That's why he set up the HLA. He was a well-respected man who always took good care of his men. So even former Yakuza members came to him with their problems. They'd all tell him that leaving the business was fine and all, but trying to make it in normal society was next to impossible. Yeah, knowing what kind of guy Kashiwagi-san was, I'm sure that he lent them a sympathetic ear. Kashiwagi-san, they were still members of his family, even though they'd already left the Yakuza. Kashiwagi-san founded the HLA as an organization that could provide these people with the support they need. Is that right? Recently, as the Tojo clan were becoming more turbulent, Kashiwagi-san turned over the management of the HLA to me. He asked me to watch over the members until they could support themselves through honest work. Now that Kashiwagi-san is no longer with us, it is my duty to fulfill his dying wish. Yeah, I can understand that. But now the HLA is facing some seri a serious problem. The guy from before, you mean? Yeah. He's a former member who got help from us once. But somebody's given him orders to hurt the members of the HLA and the Tojo clan. Why would someone do that? It's not just him. More and more former Yakuza are carrying out these kinds of attacks. They call themselves the Reapers. <clears throat> and they've obviously got an axe to grind. I need a drink. I got something stuck in my throat. <clears> throat> ah, there we go. But all these so-called Reapers used to work for the Yakuza as Hitmen. Hitmen. So we're talking about talking professional killers here. Right. We've all been all we've been able to gather so far is that somebody is organizing former Yakuza Hitman to get some kind of revenge. You think they want to wipe out the HLA? Well, not necessarily. Seeing as they've also been harassing active members of the, of the Tojo clan, the HLA is going to have to do something about this. We can't just lie down and take it. Is there anyone in the HLA who could take out these Hitmen? Unfortunately, no, seeing as our members are former Yakuza who are trying to avoid that sort of thing. Right. In any case, you just need someone to find these hitmen, catch them, and round them all up, right? What are you implying? If I went after those guys, you could focus on helping your HLA members turn their lives around. That's pretty accurate, right? Well, yes, but I couldn't ask something like that of you. I myself left the Yakuza to live an honest life, and I know how rough it can be. And I know how important it is for you to honor Kashwagi's dying wish. I'll do everything I can to help. Cure you, son. Would you really do that for us? I've got a lot of things going on right now, but I'll definitely help out whenever I get the chance. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. However, can however can I thank you for doing this? Save it for when this is all over. So what exactly do you need me to do? Let me think. HLA is using all of his resources right now how to collect information on these reapers whenever it comes convenient for you stop by and i'll give you all the info we gathered on one of the hitmen and then if you manage to find and capture that hitman give me a call and we'll take it from there all right these men will be formidable opponents you, you're better off going after them one at a time yeah that sounds reasonable and for every hitman you successfully capture the hla will offer you a reward though i'm afraid it won't be much i'm not doing this for the money but it won't be right if we didn't at least cover your expenses. Please, we insist. All right. I suppose I will need to spend some time and money getting ready to take them down. I'll accept your reward. Could I ask you one more thing? What is it? <clears throat> These Reapers aren't just calling trouble for us here in Tokyo. They've been popping up all over the country, carrying out attacks on other Tojo affiliated families. <coughs> Why is my throat so bleh? I seem to recall you saying you live in Okinawa. That's right. If we get any information on Hitman in Okinawa, do you think you could head south and handle them too? Sure, no problem. I don't know when I'll be back there next, but it'll definitely keep but definitely keep me in the loop. Alright. 
I'll reach out to you whenever we find something. And in any case, we can't shut these Reapers down for good until we find out who's behind all this. This is going to need to be difficult, but with you on our side, I know we can do this. Good luck. Alrighty. Quick pause. Okay, back in. Still doing house stuff. In fact, it's all been... The past six episodes have been recorded today. Um, let's see. Do you have anything? Your quests. It wouldn't be worth. It wouldn't be right to, you know, be offered this and not at least give it a trial run in the episode. The next room is the arcade room. Oh. Well, I didn't know that. Excuse me. Like, he, he's this young man who's always singing and playing his guitar in front of the Millennium Tower. He's pretty good, too. Since he's always there, might be able to get some good information out of him that would keep, help you keep track your targets now. Oh, okay. Why does that name sound familiar, though? That name sounds real familiar. Uh, Millennium Tower's up. So let's see if we can find this dude playing the guitar. He will point us in the right direction of where we need to go. No, I don't want to fight you. Thank you. Okay, dude playing guitar dead ahead like my song well i'm no expert but i'd say it wasn't bad i see no matter how much i play here nobody ever listens i guess it doesn't re really matter if anyone listens or not sorry about that don't mean to complain it's all right i'm hideki by the way washed up musician as you can see and you are kiryu kiryu where have i heard that name before meh i guess kiryu is a pretty common name you're the only curious son who's ever stopped to hear me sing, though. Thanks for listening. You can usually find me here. Come by and listen again sometime. Sure, if I get the chance. Sorry to keep you. See you around. Uh. Hey, curious son, what's going on? I'm looking for somebody. All I know is that he's seen on Tall Tai Hei Boulevard East. You're talking about a pretty large area. One of the most dangerous, too, especially around the Zord. In one of the most dangerous two, especially around the deserted parking lot by the entrance of the Champion District. Sounds like I'm going to have to check this deserted parking lot out. I mean the one that we have fought many a times in Kiryu? And I mean many a times. Like, I couldn't tell you how many times I knew it. God. Ha! Ha ha! I wonder. What do you want, huh? You're the dragon now. Eh. Eh. So you're back in town now, eh? Alright then, let me tell you what you need to do. Go over to the video store and say the following Say the following to the guy working there. You got the Mix Bathing Hot Springs Special? I'm telling you, it'll be worth your while. You always have to trust me on this one. After all, I'm rooting for you big time. So yeah. I thought it'd be in the van. But that wasn't the case. Okay. Uh, ignore you guys. I don't want to listen. Because if we're going to find our buddy. Uh, oh no. This is not what I wanted to try to do. You got to think before you act. If you want to land a bruise on this fresh face. You got to. Be four to five steps ahead, minimum. Found some bullshit. This is a street fight, not some goddamn chess game. I've got a record of... Four... Four hundred and ninety-nine to one. So someone managed to do it. In fact, it happened right here in Camarocho. Yeah, I bet you're just making them up in your head. Look, I could listen to you yap all day. 
But I'm running a business here, so if you've got time to cry, you should be out training instead. Well, I'd be damned, you're finally back in town. And you are? You gotta be shitting me. It's your boy, Mr. Try and Hit Me. Don't tell me you forgot. Yeah, I think I remember that. I think I'd remember a name like that. Well, to help jog your memory, I've been challenging people on the street to hit me for prize money. It ain't your average desk job, but hey, it's 11. Offer my services for 300 yen, 3,000 yen a minute. Within that, you're free to try to hit me as much as you like, with a reward of 50 grand if you're successful. Not bad, I know. Ever since you smacked me a good one, uh, oh, some two odd years back, I've been training all over Japan, vowing never to get hit again. I got up against boxers, Muay Thai experts, you name it. Now you're finally back. What kept you so long? A lot of things, actually. Well, shoot, it feels like I've been waiting forever for this day. How about challenging the new and improved me? All I have to do is hit him once. Not right now. This is not what I came here to do. I'm trying to find... I thought that would have been the parking lot, unless that is blocking me from doing the thing anyways. All I wanted to do, guys, was attempt this damn Hitman mission just to see what it was. And it's not letting me. Why? Yeah, give me two. Okay, do you know what? That's fine. 200. That makes me feel better. Because I want to be down here. Because that's not really a. Oh. That parking lot. Oh. Hold on. Priorities. Oh, you got a sledgehammer. Now that looks Batsu the Hitman. What are you doing? It's your own damn fault for joining the Yakuza. Now it's time for you to pay the price. What the hell are you talking about? Hold it right there. That's enough. Who the hell are you? You're Batsu the Hitman, aren't you? What if I am? Hey, I'll take care of this. Get out of here. Thank you. I'll never forget this. You in the biz too? Not anymore. Why? Would you kill me if I were? Yeah, that's right. The Yakuza have to be destroyed. That's extreme. What do you have against the Yakuza anyway? If you side with them, you're just as guilty as they are. You deserve to die too. Looks like talking isn't going to get us anywhere. Pay for your sins, Yakuza scum. The Reapers. Smack. That's fine. Ow, ow, ow. You're in, you think you're so, ow, ow. You and your big scary hammer, whoop. Ow, I thought I was out of range. Ow, ow, ow. Okay, we're good. Nope. 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 There we go. You see? Remember when I said Regard's gonna come in handy? It's everything that you're seeing here. Nope. Come on.
Okay. Pop. Grab. Bash. Ow. Bad angle, I know. Come on. Block. Get in. There we go. One hitman down. Ugh. Finally come to your senses? Never. I'll never forgive them. I'll never forgive them for what they did. What exactly is your problem? You were one of them once, weren't you? Yeah, that's right. When I was a kid, I joined the Yakuza. So it happened. I was a hitman for them, and then they ordered me to off key members of a rival family. They promised me a big reward and a high position in the family when my prison time was over. I spent 15 years dreaming of life after the slammer. I know how that feels. But when I finally got back to Kamurocho, the only thing watching me was an assassin to shut me up for good. During those 15 years, they called a truce with that rival family, and I just reminded them of past mistakes. I managed to escape with my life, but I'd lost everything. Ever since then, whenever I see someone in the Yakuza, I get pissed. Makes sense. The story of yours isn't exactly uncommon. What? Look, I understand where you're coming from, but that's no reason to go around attacking people who have nothing to do with what happened to you. The Honest Living Association sent me to come find you. The HLA. You can talk this whole thing over with a beaky and figure out what to do next. Great work, Kiryu-san. I'll take it from here. Biki stands waiting at, for you at headquarters. I'll accompany you there. Cool. After this, we'll go see uh, what Date has to say. Great work. I'm glad you're okay. Looks like Batsu is coming down right now. He's talking to some HLA members in the back room. Just leave him to us. Kiryu-san. Well done. Here's your reward. We appreciate the hard work. Cool. That's going to be some good money in that, for sure. What I get for experience? Load, damn it. Only two levels. Damn. Uh, we need to go... Oh, you don't rotate. That's throwing me off. Okay, that's down. Okay. Can I turn that on? Because that's bothering me now, now that we're back in Kamurocho. Gameplay. Thank you. There we go. That is much better. I've gone... 15 other episodes without that bothering me. But now that we're back in Kamurocho, it's like... A glaring issue, like, directly in my face. Sorry, I thought I saw a shiny. And I figured there'd be one here. So, Pete, stop. I was gonna say, wasn't there like a lady behind me or something? Okay. There we go. New Serena. Okay, I feel like you've been gone for hours. Have you, you have trouble finding Kanda or something? That was part of it, but also, well, what? Oh, you mind if I, if I, a uh, friend I brought up from Okinawa stays here with me? They won't be around for, uh, any longer than I am. Oh, of course. Is this, uh, a, um, special friend? I mean, any last episode was anything to go off of? No. Nah, you gotta be talking about Haruka, right? Nope, no on both counts. It's actually the captain of the Ryudu family, one of the biggest syndicates in Okinawa. And we're definitely talking about a guy here, right? Or did you hook yourself up with some big shot female Yakuza? His name's Rikia. He's still pretty much just a kid. Oh ho, in that case, he's especially welcome. We could use some young blood to freshen up the place. All I normally get is here is the middle aged farts like Date san. What's that? What's that supposed to mean? 
This is giving you a taste of your old medicine. That's what you get for calling me an old lady all the time. Well, I guess I deserve that. Anyway, you guys are welcome to stay in the back office so long as you don't cause any trouble in here. I mostly just use it for storage. I appreciate it, Mama. So, where is this guy? I don't go exper explore Kamarosho a bitch. See the sights. He's coming here when he's done. Sounds like a damn tourist. So much for work ethic. Everything okay, Tate-san? Doesn't sound like you're in a very good mood. Nah, it's nothing. Aniki. Finally found you, Aniki. Would you believe that I went in like five different bars before I end up here? Let's say he's a goddamn mace or something. This is your guy, Kiryu? Yep. Rikia, this is my friend Date-san. I can tell you how many times he's helped me over the years. Oh, and this is the mama of, the bu of this bar. Aniki's friends, huh? Pleasure to meet ya. The name's Rik Rikia Shimabukuro. Well, someone's got a lot of energy. I try, ma'am. Hmm. It's Date, pleased. Oh, the honors are all mine. Rikia, you finished looking around town? I mean, I guess, but... What's wrong? I never find that bikini bar I was looking for. I really wanted to see what kind of heat Tokyo a Tokyo one could bring to. I didn't realize it was that important to him. Anyway, Kiryu, I'm ready to hear what went down with Kana whenever you're ready to spill it. So let me know when it's time, okay? I really want to dig into the details here. So why I'm shiny. First person. Oh, gotta be even closer. Cool. Okay. You ready to talk, Kiryu? That's why I'm here. Oh. Let's talk. Great. So tell me what happened with Kanda. Well, fade to black. Oh. This is awkward. I didn't realize this would be, this was a chapter and I thought we'd just do cutscenes. Not just a hard cut to the end. So. It really has not been long enough, especially for a Yakuza Friday episode. Okay, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to cut for a second. Oh, wait, no, because I didn't save after that. And I really don't want to be starting a new chapter right now. Oh, okay, shorter episode it is. Much shorter episode. I was not expecting. Like, okay, I really want to dig into the details. Should have been parentheses. This will end the damn chapter but we all make mistakes gotta have some shorter episodes to make room for all the longer ones i normally have so you know what we'll take it with grace and then hopefully i can save and back out and it not push me through the chapter because I'm not recording more after this. I've recorded six episodes. I've recorded 12 episodes in the past two days I've recorded. I want to take a break from recording now. <laughs> Anyways. If you guys have enjoyed the very short episode today. Short by our normal standards. Let me know with a comment. Maybe even leave me a like. Both help me out tremendously. And... If you haven't already, consider leaving me a, or consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell. That way you know when more Yakuza is heading your way. That's all I got for you today. Until next time.